Welcome to the 2023 40 Under 40 Awards. I'm Michael Curran from the Ottawa Business Journal. And I'm Su Ling Ching with the Ottawa Board of Trade. Su Ling, we couldn't be more excited to be gathered at the West End Hotel here tonight in the Confederation Ballroom to celebrate these 40 business leaders for their accomplishments, for their expertise, and equally for their commitment to our city. 100%. It's such an honor to, to celebrate them, and we're so excited to have this cohort. They're so diverse in their experience their backgrounds, what they've contributed to the community and the sectors that they come from. And we've got a real multimedia show for you. We're going to have all the 40 under 40s uh, up on stage there behind me and we'll be firing some rapid fire questions at them so we can get to know their personality a little bit more. It's always such a fun evening. I encourage all of you to keep an eye on these young leaders. They're the future of our city and we want to cheer them on. And I'm cheering them on. We're both cheering them on. Here's the show. My name is Joey Pamuk. Mark Sauvé. My name is Mary Yazdani. Patrick Taifar. Jesse Card. Natasha Hope Morano. Andre Fernandez. Uh, my name is Adol Jahari. My name is Victoria Lavalle. My name is Derek Cottenham. Nitin Mero. My name is Julia Heinzman. My name is Brendan Duval. I'm Candace Shaw. Michelle Copivo. My name is Ryan Peets. I'm Bradley Crapo. My name is Dr. Jesse McAllister. My name is Hannah Elanid. My name is Adam Van Cleef. My name is Jessica Barrow. My name is Dave Hale. My name is Rohit Sakar. Elizabeth Odette Bourdeau. My name is Connor McGarry. I'm Devin Pinnell. My name is Jackie Bonestiel. My name is Todd Shannon. My name is Kyle Sutar. My name is Mahima Sharma. My name is Matt Henley. My name is Pavel Bogdanov. Ginger Bertram. My name is Michael Nelson. Thomas Triplett. My name is Kelly Russ. I'm Tristan Smith. My name is Gregory MacDonald. My name is Emma Mons. My name is Priya Yoganathan. Hello, everyone. Congratulations to all of the recipients. I am continually amazed at what uh, these young people are doing uh, for the city of Ottawa, launching businesses, creating jobs, and solving some pretty complex problems. The uh, executive MBA at uh, the Telfer School of Management has been sponsoring the 40 on the 40 for 20 years now. We're pretty proud of the fact that we've been affiliated with this program for so long. The main reason we do it is because uh, we know that uh, these young folks uh, have uh, a great impact on what goes on in the city of Ottawa. We do a similar thing. Our students will do approximately 50 projects a year. Uh, these projects are for small businesses, hospitals, not-for-profit organizations. And so we have that kind of impact in, in Ottawa in helping businesses grow, uh, helping them achieve their objectives. So that's the main reason we're affiliated, is because we see that there's some affinity between what we do in the program and what the 40 on the 40 uh, recipients have been doing over the last few years. So again, uh, congratulations. Uh, our program has uh, grown over the uh, last, I would say, three years. We have uh, put in some new technology that allows us to actually expand outside of Ottawa. So we've had students from the north, from Nunavut, for example, from Toronto, from Montreal, and so as this 40 on the 40 program uh, develops and evolves, our program is also developing and evolving. And so we hope to continue this affiliation for many years in the future. Thank you all again and uh, congrats. Please welcome to the stage from Telfer EMBA, Gregory Richard. Our first recipient of the night is Henny Al Anid from Kalyan. Congratulations, Henny. Next up, we've got Elizabeth Odette Bordeaux from Welby.
Congratulations, Elizabeth. Coming from Pearlie Robertson Hill and McDougal, LLP, here is Jessica Barrow. Congratulations, Jessica. And here comes Ginger Bertram from Gab Group. Congratulations, Ginger. Next from Ottawa Flowers, here is Pavel Bogdanov. Congratulations, Pavel. Thank you, Telfer ENBA and Gregory Richards. Bonsoir tout le monde. I'm going to do a little throwback for you. So about a month and a half ago, this pro uh, PGA um, golfer from a public course named Michael Block managed to finish 15th in the PGA Championship. And he played on Sunday with Rory. And in, in, in his own words, in the end, he said, you know what, this was the best weekend of my life. I was living the dream. So I hope in return that you are living your dream right now. This is, you know, a big moment for you. Probably not the last one. You're all very successful. And do be thankful to the people that surround you and appreciate all the efforts that got you here today. Donc, je suis Mathieu Saint-Denis, je suis un des récipiendaires de l'année 2022 au nom de BDO Canada. Je vous dis félicitations d'être lauréat 2023. Please welcome to the stage from BDO, Jeffrey Johnson. And here comes Jacqueline Bonasteel from Corporate Immigration Law Firm. Congratulations, Jacqueline. Up next, we've got from Youth Ottawa, here is Jesse Card. Congratulations, Jesse. From Caravita, here comes Michelle Corivo. Congratulations, Michelle. Here comes the chef. From my catering group, here is Derek Cottenham. Congratulations, Derek. Here comes number 10 from Food Cycle Science. This is Bradley Crepo. Congratulations, Bradley. 
Congratulations, Bradley. Thank you from BDO and Jeffrey Johnson. I'm a lawyer. I acquire construction companies. I help foreign investors to establish their business successfully in Canada. We bring your mechanical piping in and out of your buildings. I lead all strategic direction and operations at the organization. I advocate on behalf of specific causes that my clients ask me to lobby on behalf of. We remove greenhouse gases from the atmosphere. I oversee uh, and manage all of the different uh, franchise operations, including coaching all of the franchisees. I help run my family's landscaping business. I help people celebrate with food and drink. Uh, we are ambassadors for our food and culture. I'm a corporate commercial and real estate lawyer with Soloway Wright. I create lasting memories uh, for our fans and members of the business community. I help anyone selling anything online make more money. I adjust people. I'm a chiropractor. We're trying to eliminate the world's food waste problem. We help keep Canada's nuclear infrastructure safe and secure. I help people love their smiles. I amplify the voice of the customer. I like to architect opportunities. I advance my clients' stories through advocacy. I take ideas and turn them into products. Helping people make the complex simple. I help older adults live a better life for longer. I solve marketing and communications problems. I'm an entrepreneur. I help people to come to Canada or stay in Canada. I'm the co-founder and COO of AI Talos. Well, we help people celebrate life's special occasions. I am an environmental leader and a believer in innovation. We help generate, standardize, and share data securely. I build innovative AI solutions for a more sustainable future for all. I help businesses grow with their marketing. I support the economic prosperity of Indigenous communities. I support survivors of sexual and gender-based violence. I help businesses maximize their value. I protect the business and push it forward. I create decadent bath rituals. I turn talent into brands. Healing patients through R&D. Please welcome to the stage from your Ottawa Senators, Aaron Crow. And from your Ottawa Senators, here is Brendan Duval. Congrats to Brendan. Up next, from Invert, we've got Andre Fernandez. Congratulations. Andre. And here comes from Craft and Crew, the one and only Dave Hale. to Dave from Soloway Right LLP Julia Huntsman Congratulations Julia. Next up, from AI Talos, we've got Matthew Henley. Congratulations, Matthew. 
Thank you, Ottawa Senators and Aaron Crow. Where is your happy place? My happy place? You talking to me? My happy place would be in the bathtub or in bed. My happy place is my bed. Uh, definitely inside a kitchen. At my pool with my kids. My happy place is at Antigua on the beach, which is where I was raised. <laughs> it's a tank, I don't know. My happy place in Ottawa is walking along the canal. Being anywhere close to the ocean, walking along the beach. Uh, at home with my uh, newborn little girl. In a canoe in the still waters of Georgian Bay with my family. Remove myself from screens, uh, preferably out in nature. Where's your happy place? At home with my husband and my two cats. With my wife and two kids, uh, personally. And professionally, it's in the office with my team. When a client has no changes. My happy place is at home with my husband and my daughter and my soon-to-be son. I like sitting back with my wife on the patio, somewhere hot. I play with my son. Uh, I enjoy doing some powerlifting and watching a lot of sports. My happy place. Happy place? At home with my family and kids. Hanging out at home on the couch, watching some TV, having some snacks with my husband. Waking up each morning with uh, two beautiful daughters under each arm. My happy place is at home. <laughs> out front of our house, watching the kids play on the road. On the golf course. My happy place is Manitoulin Island, Ontario. West Coast by the Rockies, where I used to live. Getting outside, doing something physical. Poolside, possibly with a drink. With my family. At home with my family, with my daughter. Nature is my happy place. The horse barn or at home with my dogs. Please welcome to the stage one of our judges and past recipient, Joelle Hall. And up next, we've got Natasha Hope Morano from NHM Connect. Congratulations, Natasha! And from Rydell Roofing, here's Abdel Jari. Congrats to Adele! Hey, here comes Cityscape, it's Victoria Lavallee! A big congratulations to Victoria! Up next, from Bathorium, we've got Greg McDonald. There goes Greg from McAllister Dentistry. Here is Jesse McAllister. Congratulations, Jesse! And thank you to Joelle Hall. Testing. All right, give it up for the first 20 recipients. Wow. And I'm going to get Gregory Richards up and Laura Nowitzki. Here comes Greg.
You saw him on video, and uh, Greg, the Telfer Executive MBA has been a partner with 40 Under 40 for so many years, and we'll make room for Laura. Come on up. Come on up, Laura. We'll come this way, Greg. Okay. Take center stage, as they say. Uh, Greg, and so much has changed, right, in the world of business because of the pandemic and that, and yet, you know, I think the Executive MBA program at Telfer is still playing such a a special role in preparing young business people for their futures. Tell us why people should be considering an EMBA at Telfer. Uh, I got 150 slide deck to oh, show okay. you. Would that be good? Good, Start good. <laughs> well, I, I think we do uh, two things. Uh, we do a lot of things, but two things that are key. One is the, the knowledge to be agile, innovative, and flexible because so much is changing, uh, Michael. And two, we connect you to our network of 1,300 alumni, some of them who are here tonight, right, at this table over here. Uh, and that's important because uh, more businesses are working together than ever before, so networks are, are critical. I could go on with my other 149 slides, but I'll stop there. Okay. Well, it, I, there's no denying in my mind that Telfer EMBA is doing a big, uh, big, big, big impact, and, you know, your recipients are throughout the CEO and executive community. Ladies and gentlemen, we got Laura Nowitzki, who just graduated this just a, just a few days ago, I think, Laura? Yes, from the EMB. June, June, okay. It's coming up still. But uh, we wanted to get your first-hand impression of the program and, and perhaps uh, how it prepared you for the future. Absolutely. So um, program life-changing. Okay. Life-changing uh, from my team. So, I mean, just beautifully curated by the program. Um, I had a team of four uh, from all walks of life, all different levels of experience, uh, job experience, backgrounds, uh, just really added to the depth and breadth of my learning and experience, for sure. Okay. And, and how do you think it's prepared you to propel yourself into the future of work here? Well, hands down, the executive MBA got me the role that I'm in right now. Okay. Hands down. There was no way I would have been able to uh, be successful in this role or have been selected. Um, actually, uh, the, the position I'm in now in public health, I obtained in the fall, so halfway through the program. And um, I just feel that the EMBA has beautifully positioned me or armed me with the necessary tools yeah. and techniques and knowledge base to help me make that to bridge that gap between you know operational and managerial competency to more leadership, visionary, strategist kind of mindset, which regardless of sector, industry, or organization is paramount for any executive. And, and let's check your age. Are you still eligible for 40 under 40? Sorry, what was that? Are you still, uh, how old are you? Are you still eligible for, for I, I'm just preparing myself for a to see a nomination here. 33. Oh, 33, she's still good. All right, give it up for Telfer EMBA. There's the first 20 recipients. Here comes the second half. Here we go. What is your favorite healthy activities? My favorite healthy activity? I love gardening. Healthy? You mean like, like an exercise or something? Like I don't know what to say here. A healthy activity. <laughs> My favorite healthy activity is running. La nage. <laughs> On the back of a horse, horseback riding. Going to the gym. Anything really in nature. Eating pizza is a pretty healthy activity. Well, okay, well, let's do that again. Morning green juices. A long bike ride. Uh, I really enjoy deadlifting. I like lifting heavy things off the floor. Skiing with my family. I like to run. Going to the gym. Swimming. <laughs> Actually, I don't really do very much. <laughs> um. Favorite healthy activity. Again, going to the gym, usually at noon. My favorite healthy activity is running. Practicing yoga. Riding my road bike. Tennis. Meditation. I love to go camping with the, with the family and my dogs. Wow, that was easy. Please welcome to the stage one of our judges, Robert Riom. And from Welch Capital Partners Inc. Walk it up, it's Connor McGarry. So long, Connor. 
another chef coming to the stage from East India Company. Here is Nateen Mira. Congratulations, Nitin. And from Canaxis, we've got Emma Mons. Thank you, Robert Reum. What one word describes your leadership style? Man, I don't know. One word. One word? Competitive. Cooperative. <laughs> my leadership style? You should ask my employees, not me. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Active. Compassionate, but firm. Authentic. Fun. Transformative. I'm not a micromanager. Hmm. Trust. Leadership style. I like to lead by example. Direct. Engaged. Oh, my leadership style? Collaborative. Transparent. Human. Empathy. Innovative. Inclusive. Passionate. My leadership style is based on empathy. Leadership style? Empowering. Open. Resilient. Compassionate. Transformational. Integrity. My leadership style is adaptable. Energetic. I'm collaborative and get the job done. Trusting. Inspiration. My leadership style is adaptability and laughter. <laughs> my leadership style, I would say, is pretty unique. I'm not my team's boss. I'm their friend. Please welcome to the stage from Oakwood Custom Homes and Renovations, Amani Lele. Upcoming, here is Ryan Pete from Proxy IT Corp. Congrats to Ryan. Up next, we've got Devin Pennell. Congratulations, Devin. And here comes from Kelly Russ Consulting, the one and only Kelly Russ. A 
big congratulations to Kelly. And from David Sove LLP, it's Mark Sove. Congrats to Mark. And from Human Contact, we've got Todd Shannon. A big congrats to Todd. Thank you to Oakwood and Amani. At the end of a long working week, how do you recharge? Recharge? Uh, recharger. At the end of a long week, j'aime faire des petits sports. Right now I recharge with my boxing training. So I jump on the Peloton for 30 minutes, and then I enjoy my nice deck in the backyard. I go see my horses or my dogs at home. How do I recharge at the end? A relaxing dinner with my husband and children. Uh, recharging always is at the golf course. I think we might need some help with this one. Like, I... How do I recharge? I love time to read and get a good run in. What do other people like to do? Nine holes of golf, uh, followed by a backyard barbecue. Recharge. I like sitting back with my wife on the patio. Uh, not sure I figured that one out yet. Exercise, have a really good meal, and just watch some good television. How, how do I recharge? I play with my son. With the kids, just sitting around telling stories about the week. I recharge by watching reality TV. Hanging out at home on the couch, watching some TV, having some snacks with my husband. On the golf course. By spending time with my family and going for a run on the trails. With my running shoes, out on the road. I recharge, um, how do I recharge? Poolside, possibly with a drink. I like to binge watch a lot of Netflix and go to bed at 8.30 at night. Taking a bath. Do I ever recharge? I don't know. Bed. By sleeping. I recharge with a big glass of wine. Smoke some shisha. <laughs> Please welcome to the stage Ottawa Print Services, Hamid Zaydeh. And from the Forest Products Association of Canada, Mahima Sharma. Congratulations, Mahima. And next to the stage, we've got Candice Shaw from the Ottawa Rape and Crisis Center. There goes Candice. And from War Shield, here comes Kristen Smith. We accept this award on behalf of Tristan. group. It's Kyle Sutar. Congratulations. 
Legends Kyle. From Piper Plumbing and Heating, it's Patrick Kuiper. Congratulations to Patrick. Thank you again to Ottawa Print Services and Hamid Zadeh. What an incredible group of rising business stars we have here tonight. You are our new leaders. You develop, you innovate, you expand, you bring growth to our economy. We're so fortunate to have such a wealth of talent in our region. Hi, my name is Lisa Razin, Director of Sales and Marketing at the Casino in Hilton, Lac Limi, your entertainment resort in Ottawa Gatineau. Congratulations to you, bright, passionate, and innovative young entrepreneur. So proud to be celebrating this event with you tonight. Continue the great work that you do every day, and let's make Ottawa Gatineau the best place to work, live, and play. Bonne soirée à tous. Please welcome to the stage from Casino Lac Limi, Lise Sarrazin. Up next, we've got Rohan Takar from Flash Inc. We will accept this award on behalf of Rohan. There goes Rohan from Blue Wave AI. It's Thomas Triplett. Thomas! And from Full Script, we've got Adam Van Cleef. Congratulations to Adam. And in the penultimate spot, we've got Mary Yazdani from Genesis Link Consulting Services. Yoga Nathan from the Ottawa Hospital Research Institute. I got two sentences for you. How was your meal? How was the service? Thank you so much, Western Ottawa. Thank you for helping the Hilton Lac Limi in our challenging time. 
And that shows how the uh, industry of tourism has a lot of class and supporting. And I know the business community works together in hand developing economic development in Ottawa so we make Ottawa a better place to live. So that was message number one. Message number two, congratulations and have a good time. Please welcome back to the stage, Su Ling Ching and Michael Curran. All right, we're in the final stretch. Just a few more uh, quick items. And first off, uh, I want to thank our judges. We saw many of them on stage. These judges go through about 20 hours to 30 hours of their personal time. So that means we've got about uh, 200. Uh, uh, Joelle's giving me the thumbs up. She's like, it's way more than that. So I want to, uh, so that's about 100 hours total. I'd ask them to stand up and be recognized by the entire hall. We got Joelle Hall. We got Ann Helen from OBJ, Jeffrey Johnson's over there from BDO, and Robert Rayom, the former managing partner, now retired, and board member of the Ottawa Board of Trade. Giant round of applause for our judges. The 40 Under 40 there is a very special group of people. At this point, we're now at over 1,000. You got it. 1,040. Uh, 40 Under 40 in Ottawa. We want to acknowledge all of this alumni. And Mark, Michael, you always say the alumni of the 40 Under 40, they stay connected. They really, uh, they really do a lot in our community together. So everyone here who's a 40 under 40 alumni, this please This will be interesting. Rise. Stand up please if you're rise. 40 under 40. Look at this. Look at them. They dot the landscape. I see Pascal. Woo! I see Pierce. Woo! Beautiful. Look at this strength in our business community. Isn't that exciting? So thank you to all the 40 Under 40 alumni who are here to support the new cohort. Yeah, you got it. That's right. And listen, uh, we've got full bios on each of the 2023 recipients. We've got the summer edition of OBJ News Magazine. You can find it outside in the corridor. I saw many copies. And uh, don't forget, uh, you can keep us trending for the entire night at Ot 40 as So we, as you continue to celebrate your night, keep using that hashtag, hashtag Ot 40 and before we go, we want to give one more thank you to our sponsors and partners. To the Telfer Executive MBA, thank you so much. To BDO, the Casino de Lac Limi Desjardins, the Concilio Financial Group Chambers Plan, Ottawa Prince Services, Oakwood, the Ottawa Senators, our charity partner. Listen to this. You don't even know this. We oh, just found out. What? So we wanted to raise about five to $10,000 for our great friends at Onfi Junior Achievement. Yes. I'm told by Mitch, we're way above $16,000 oh, tonight. Wow. Congratulations. Isn't that great? Thank Isn't that you. fantastic? So our charity partner, of course, Onfi, our event, uh, partner is Event Design, Modern Activations, Future Vision, and Ottawa Flowers. Thank you to the incredible work of the West, West in Ottawa. Once again, thank you, Ross Meredith, sitting right there. Big round of applause for this guy. Thank you, Michael, and thank you to everyone in this room for making such a special night. We hope you had a fabulous time. The night is young. Please stick around. We have music. The bar is open. Enjoy, and we'll see you next year at the 40 Under 40. Good night. Good night, everyone. Bonsoir. Raising the bar. And I always win Everything done is a perfect 10 So when it comes to the bar It's higher than it's ever been Raising the bar So high can it come this far Raising the bar To this, I am and they don't miss everything I do. So, Chris, who's touching my song? No Think you can beat my swag? No. Wait a minute, hold my bag. I'ma show you how to work. All the time, ground go berserk. That's why I'ma get my words. Never subpar. I was born to be a star. When I shine, I'm raising the bar. I'm raising the bar. Higher than it's ever been. 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 I'm a boss and I always win. Everything done is a perfect 10. So when it comes to the bar, 
it's higher than it's ever been. One better can't even imagine it. Higher than it's ever been. 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 I'm a boss and I always win. Everything done is a perfect 10. So when it comes to the bar, the bar is higher than it's ever been. Raising the bar. Aha, aha. Raising the bar. Aha, aha. Jump this far, raising the bar. Raising the bar. So how can it jump this far? Raising the bar. Higher than it's ever been. Raising the bar. Raising the bar. Raising the bar.
diamond of the world Now it's time to seize your day
Leave a message at the beep. Thank you for calling, calling, calling. <laughs> 